Hello and welcome to Nikolai's genetics lessons and today I have prepared two multiple choice questions for you. Here's the first question. If an organism is trisomy 21, how many total chromosomes do they have? And here's uh, five answers to choose from. And uh, this picture would help me to uh, explain how many uh, chromosomes in this case we can find. So trisomy is a situation when uh, one of the chromosomes instead of two copies of course all the chromosomes as you see in diploid organism are present in two copies uh, in such organism would have three copies of the same chromosome in our case trisomy 21 would have three copies of the chromosome 21 usually trisomy only can happen with uh, smallest chromosomes. So we can find trisomy uh, in this range, not for all chromosomes. Uh, organism can tolerate extra chromosome, but uh, the smallest chromosomes, of course, would have the smallest number of genes. The other name of the trisomy 21 is Down syndrome. And actually, chromosome 21 is the smallest chromosome in our uh, karyotype. Uh, you know that uh, all the chromosomes arranged uh, from biggest to smallest. So you may think that chromosome 22 is the smallest, but this is actually not so. Because uh, this karyotype were made before uh, scientists were able to sequence our genome and when they sequence genome it turned out that chromosome 21 is the smallest in our uh, karyotype in our organism but uh, scientific notation didn't change so uh, if you would count all the autosomes and uh, we call autosomes all the chromosomes that is uh, not sex chromosomes uh, you would find that we have 22 pairs of chromosomes and one pair of sex chromosomes. So this is, uh, as you see, karyotype of the male. Males has uh, one X chromosome and one Y chromosome. So total number would be 23 pairs. This gives us a um, normal number of chromosomes 46, so one extra Chromosome 21 would give us number 47. And scientific notation would be uh, 47. Then we provide information if it is a male or female. So if it is male, uh, this is going to be X, Y. And then we give information which uh, chromosome has trisomy. In uh, this example, this is going to be trisomy 21 so this is going to be notation for a male and notation for female would be 47 x x plus 21 so as you see the correct answer is answer c and next question uh, during anaphase of meiosis the chromosomes failed to separate properly this cause um, there to be an uneven amount distributed to the resulting daughter cells. What is this called? And uh, we have four answers here. As you see, the most uh, suitable would be separation failure and non-disjunction. And we can use, of course, both these uh, terms, but uh, answer A would be more appropriate we call such situation in genetics as non-disjunction of chromosomes so we can say that non-disjunction during meiosis of the chromosome 21 uh, may cause uh, trisonomy 21 and the same non-disjunction of the chromosome 21 also lead to uh, monosomy of the 21 when one chromosome would be lost but our organism uh, human organism doesn't tolerate uh, losing any of the chromosomes we know situations uh, where some of the chromosomes 
may have extra copy, but losing one copy of the chromosome is not tolerated by our organisms, except, um, for example, uh, chromosome uh, Y chromosome, because females don't have Y chromosome at all. And uh, also, uh, another example would be uh, losing uh, chromosome, uh, one of the X chromosomes. Uh, also, our organism can tolerate this because uh, in females, those females has two X chromosomes, one would be deactivated, so only one active chromosome uh, would be per one cell. So, if female would lose one chromosome completely, uh, this would cause some genetic uh, problems, but uh, such situations can be easily tolerated by our organism. So our organism can tolerate losing one X chromosome or Y chromosome completely. And this is all for today. Thank you for your attention. Please subscribe for my new videos that I post almost every day. Thumbs up if you like this video. Please write your comments, questions if you have any. And see you in the next video. Goodbye.